All right, spuds, Dylan McWhiskey here. Welcome back to Let's Play uh, Sid Meier Civilization VI. Uh, where we left off, I think we had finished the pyramids and we were building the Petra and a couple of other things. Uh, we still have a little bit of a barb problem, but I think our problems are less than they were uh, <laughs> only a, a few short turns ago. We have managed to more or less deal with the problem. But there's still a little bit of work to be done. Now, let me. Oh, was. What's this? Someone created Stonehenge. Okay, we finished a trade route. We have a pasture. I would really, really like to go back to building um, settlers, but the barbarians just won't let me. Wow, how did you not kill that? That's really unfortunate. You're dead. My bad. I thought you would kill it. I should have checked it. I was playing too fast for myself. Okay, so we can put back in production of settlers. And finish that. Now, let me just double check with this. So construct a campus. Hmm. We're going to want a couple campuses soon then. Maybe after Petra and another settler. Like I said in the last video, we're not particularly trying to play optimally we're just trying to play in a way that i think is interesting uh so you should you should go there and repair that tile actually you should harvest that tile is what you should do uh ha, 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 ha. yes you can now make your way over here finally we're getting a builder over to this guy and he badly needs one huh probably a fairly questionable war here invincibility lies in uh, the Lord made his really don't know what to say about that. We should move there. Oh, I should have moved them adjacent to each other. At least you're guarding that. Remove that improvement and then chop it out. I'm going to use that hill for a district. Um. Yeah, I don't know what to pick here. Military tactics, this is not particularly interesting. Let's grab. I don't want to get out of the evil area yet. Oh no, he already left it. Got some points going there. Let me see. Archery? No, I don't want to backfill technologies. Uh, we could probably use aqueduct. No. Beach tower? What about the next era? What could we use? Yeah, we could use apprenticeships. Kind of wasted my turns here by playing poorly. I'm kind of screwed up a little bit, but it'll be fine. Oh, you should be able to promote now. And you should be able to get in the way of that guy. Let's see here. Can you harvest this? Settlers. Yes, do a harvest. And this trade route is going to want to go to. Wait. What? Oh, Candy has declared war on me. I mean, fine, that's okay. Let's set this guy over to Sparta. Okay. Sparta needs a bit of help. Uh, ho, 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 ho. You make your way over there. The Petra is going to be done pretty soon. Knowledge of construction has considerably advanced. Okay, you're going to want to build me uh, a granary. Because you are not in good shape. You rest. Do I have any more barbarian encampments to deal with? Not really. I think we're kind of cleared on barbs, so we can do a little bit of scouting with these hoplites. We have another copy of tobacco that I would like to trade. You should go to Athens. Get a road going. So I work on killing those scouts. 
perhaps I will recruit a great writer. And now we're in medieval era of great writers. We're going to want to build a amphitheater right after that. Create a great work. Excellent. So that's one great work, nice and early. We can chop here, and we will repair that. I keep saying I will get builders over here one day, so I'm just, you know what? I'm just, uh, I'm done. I'm gonna, I'm gonna purchase a builder. I get extra value out of them anyway because I am uh, the builder of the Great Pyramids. So I'm gonna wanna. I'm going to want to settle along this river, Petra probably. Is a brilliant display of man's Excellent, we finished Petra. And uh, I believe I believe building uh, wonders gives you tourism. So we badly need this uh, amphitheater to have somewhere to put our great works of writing that we're sitting on right now. And we're going to want a campus. And I think even though... Well, I could put a commercial district there, so... Uh, the flatland adjacent to capital is acceptable, I think. No, I need more. I need more settlers. I can't afford to do that. I need at least three more. So one, two, two more, two more built. While we explore. Probably not, you know, if this was a multiplayer game, I wouldn't be expanding while I'm at war. I'm going to want to grab this land here. I'm a, we might do another round of settling later. We'll chop out this guy. And then get another one. I think that's going to cover our settlers for at least the next two to three eras. Um, see, what tiles are you working? Yeah, you're working. I accidentally build a mine there and then crush it with necropolis. That was dumb of me if I did do that. I want to mine there. And Qian, you're going to want to just wait on top of that. For now. Huh. Send. Uh, we're going to want one coastal, I think, here. Because, wait, is there any luxuries? Preferably settling for coastal luxuries. I'm going to want one coastal at least, though, just to, just to have a coastal city. And then we're going to want one on this river system here. Now, the tiles you are working are these. And uh, maybe an industrial district here. So we'll, uh, we'll improve that first. Uh, the AI isn't really a threat on this level of difficulty. But again, I've probably I've kind of said this a couple of times. We weren't really looking to be challenged. I just wanted to kind of relax with the gameplay and just kind of casually enjoy, um, casually enjoy a game of Civ. Let's see, oh, I would like that cotton in my borders. Perhaps I could settle on that wheat. I don't like the idea of leaving gaps. So what if I settle on the cotton and then there? about there one two three and then there it's not very good what if i settled one tile up yeah that's better and settling there get this farm online it's a pretty strong tile there is no yeah. easy way to go. apprenticeship finished up and let's see here Construction mill. Um, hills adjacent to an encampment district. We get some machinery. In case the AI does actually show up with some units. Uh, but, well, you know, I'm not worried. Not worried in the slightest, to be honest. Let me just double check real quick what my timer is here I lost track of it okay yeah sorry about that your knowledge of stirps has 
increased. That's great. So we can finally get rid of this, I think, and actually change our classical republic. Because we're not interested in building wonders at the moment. So plus one production per cities. Newly trained builders get two charges. Um, we're not building settlers. We're not building wonders. Plus two influence towards earning city-state envoys. And... Trade routes, gold. These are all things I want to get rolling in my empire. So, if I'm settling there, one, two, three, I'm going to want to settle like here and then backfill with maybe a city or two. Yeah, a little bit of backfilling. You get up over there, you get up onto that river. We'll be backfilling later on in the game. Uh, maintain four trade routes, kill a unit with a quadrireem. Allows alliances. Yes, we're going to want civil service because it's a decent... Um, a decent thing. And then we're going to want... Hmm, probably Merchant Republic. So let's get to work here. All right, we're not we're not building any um more settlers for a little while. So we I think it's time we cracked out a campus here, and that's going to be our commercial hub. So the campus could probably squeeze in there. Although we're going to want to think about where our industrial hub goes. Um, not really very good many places for our industrial hub. Industrial hub, commerce, campus, commerce. I don't want to crush this guy's hill. Commerce, campus? Yeah. That's how that's going to work for me. Uh, now, Sparta, you have built a few things, and you're going to want to build a Something with housing. Hmm. That's a hard thing to find right now in the current atmosphere, but maybe you could crack out me a propolis for me. And then drop an industrial zone there. We'll see. Yeah, but we're not like like I uh broken record at this point. We're not looking to play 100 percent uber optimally. We are just fiddling around. A casual game of Civ with friends. Let's see. I want you to stay relatively near. Probably want to get you all garrisoned up because we're going to have a policy for plus one amenity for garrisoned units soon. So you make your way over there. Although I want to skirt away from that if it's possible. You make your way over to this Acropolis. Plus one production there, so you're definitely still working that tile. And then we're going to want another quarry over there. I know quarries aren't particularly strong, and normally I would just harvest them, but I wanted to uh, try a different different sort of game. Doing a little bit of chariot scouting. Um, oh, no, I want to settle next to a hill. You work that hill for now. You make a granary. You're going to need it. Stockholm is in a pretty good mood with me. So where did I decide on this? If I'm settling there, one, two, three, maybe there or here. Yeah, this feels better. Settle on the marsh. And get on top of the Acropolis and wait there because next turn you'll be able to go into it. I'm going to just kind of finish off scouting down here with that guy. 
Do a little more scouting. Scouting. Oh, I found Brazil cities. And he is not a, not a good movie, but I can probably farm him for a little experience. Okay. I am going to want another holy site, though. Uh, am I? I don't know. I think I can actually get away with... Although... Let me see here. Yes, because I'm going to be per doing a lot of purchasing of... Um, of things with faith. So a holy site here makes sense. Because I can get away with it. Although I would like a compass. Oh, you can uh, make your next great work. Excellent. So their tourism game, I think we are leading. Yes. Okay. Now, there is a... Oh, sorry. I'm scrolling like a dumbass. There is a thing that is in my mind that I wanted to check, which is this. We are pretty close to our next great writer. Which means, how many turns away are we, roughly? Oh my goodness, stop scrolling like that. I might have to turn off edge scrolling and just start using the arrow keys exclusively. I think I will do that in a moment. We're actually only a couple of turns away. Can I purchase with faith the amphitheater? I can, when I need to. Well, let me go into options here. Uh, interface. Disable scroll when at edge. Okay, I probably should have turned that off earlier. But now I have much more control over my camera, which should probably improve the viewing experience at least, uh, if nothing else. Let's see here. Oh, a V unit. Yeah, let's make another one of those. Let's make sure we're working that tile. Uh, probably going to chop that and put a mine on it, get the extra hammers out of it. Recorded history. Great scientist points would be interesting right now, I think, actually. Uh, let's see, what do we got here, great scientist wise? I think we're going to have enough great. Um, yes, there. I think we're going to have enough. Um, And of great writer, writer points on its own. So I think we're going to switch over to great scientist points just to see if we can get a couple of those uh, nice and early. Let's see if we can get any value out of that. Go garrison that city. Uh, you're in a bad spot. You should back up a little bit. You should settle. Oh dear. Why didn't I escort it? Why didn't I escort it? I'm a dumbass. I am a huge, huge dumbass. I thought I had escorted that unit. Oh well. Let me begin. Pack it up, pack it in. Uh, probably granary. Oh wait, no, you're fine. You're on a river, so you can uh, you could do watermill. I think I just settle on the cotton now, just to prevent getting screwed. Which is unfortunate. I would have liked to settle there to uh, be in a better position, but you know, here's fine. Totally acceptable. We still have a hill beside us, right? Yes. Okay. So it's not the end of the world. Uh, you are going to need a granary though. I know this isn't optimal because I'm not getting commerce hubs or trade routes or anything, which could really help my cities. Oh dear. There is a huge problem coming my way. Recruit a writer. Purchase an amphitheater. Go there, create a great work. And can I now sue for peace? How would you like peace? I cannot accept this deal. How would you like to make peace? I cannot accept this deal. So I'm probably going to have to go, excuse me, pikemen, and get a lot of pikemen. Uh, 
shop out this district here. We're gonna be producing, yeah. All right, uh, one more turn, and then I can start making them. We're gonna want to start building walls in these cities. Make your way north. I wasn't expecting the AI to attack so competently. Let's see if we can. The taxpayer. I purchase a. Uplight, no. You start making uplights. You also start making a hoplight. I need to get into that city to give it a defense bonus. This city's probably dead, but I'll be able to get it back. Damn, I need a. Uh, I need to change government to probably oligarchy. So let me have a look here. And because I'm, you know, because I'm not playing efficiently, I'm actually, you know, being challenged by the AI because I'm kind of constraining myself to play in a particular way. Stirrups, do we have horses? We do not have horses. That is very unfortunate. Although I think knights only take iron, so we might be able to get some value out of that. We need a more pikemen. We need this guy to get to the front line. Probably going to upgrade him next turn. Although we don't have iron to do that. Can you get into the city? No, you cannot. Okay, so he's in the city. You're gonna to want to fortify. Keep going. Yeah, we need one iron, which is unfortunate. We just never got this online. I didn't prioritize it. Uh, probably is a mistake in hindsight. So we're pretty close to upgrading this guy. Let me keep pushing. I'm pretty sure once I get Pikeman over there, I'll be able to hold this off. New inventions, but there are very on this city is almost certainly dead if I do not purchase a unit to defend it. Slingers won't help. Okay, I made it stronger, so it should have a better chance at surviving. We're going to need crossbowmen. Fortify, kill that so it stops annoying me. Bravery is being the only one who knows. Uh, with your military tradition, okay, change government, oligarchy, yes. We are going to want. Uh, Towards Rena medieval renaissance, we're not going to want builder charges. We're going to want plus one hammer. We don't need these right now. We need as much hammers as possible. Uh, gold is actually important, as is you know maintenance reduction. major victory we can start slamming these units from within the city uh we can get the major bonus from this guy now so we are producing extra sorry about that my doorbell was just rang it's unfortunate timing probably have to put a cut in there Huh. 
although I do think that's probably a good time to leave off the episode. We have a few things going on, but we're working on surviving them. I think uh make do with just a couple rounds of pikemen. I think this will actually be enough. We have walls here. Back to building these things. You should get a builder because I'm just not going to be able to get one over there at any time. Send an envoy. That's fine. All right, let's uh, let's have a, let's do a little quick review of our world rankings right now. So we are we are last in the military strength, and yet we're holding off these guys, which is you know to be expected. We're not against the AI in this game; isn't very challenging. And tourism. Let's have a look at score. Science. We are. We're not top. We're near the top. In culture, we are getting there. I don't know what this is. It's domestic tourists. Okay. Um. Maybe, oh, sorry. We finished off checking this. Domination. Okay. And religion. Okay. I think for now that this is going to cover up the episode. Sorry, I was a little bit thrown off by that doorbell. So my, my brain processes have just gone into um, deactive mode. Uh, I think we're doing okay in terms of the gameplay based on us crippling ourselves by not going immediately for commercial, industrial, and campuses. We kind of went for different build order and it's making an interesting game you know we've got stuff going on but i think this is going to finally signal the end of the episode and i would just like to thank you for stopping by and watching with me and uh i hope to see you in the next episode and uh please don't forget to like and comment and subscribe and all that jazz and uh that'll be it no matter how dirty it makes me to say it i kind of have to say it uh it does really help the channel out i'll see you guys later Bye bye